Tonight, federal leaders visited communities affected by Hurricane Helene Wednesday afternoon. One of them was FEMA's deputy administrator, Eric Hooks. His visit comes as former President Trump and some Republicans have accused FEMA of incompetence. Reporter Avery Gingrich spoke with Hooks and Elizabeth Den about those accusations, and he brings us that story. Downtown Elizabethton hummed along Wednesday afternoon. October's arrived, but Hurricane Helene lingers. FEMA's Deputy Administrator Eric Hooks visited the Multi-Agency Resource Center near downtown during a tour of recovery sites in East Tennessee. It has been tremendous. You know, there are always a lot of challenges when you have a major and complicated storm that impacts a community like that, but there are a lot of assets that are on the ground. Some national leaders disagree. They stole the FEMA money just like they stole it from a bank so they could give it to their illegal immigrants. Hooks says FEMA was coordinating with Tennessee's leaders before Helene and centers like Elizabethans are the result. He says misinformation hurts recovery efforts. Impacts the staff, the morale that they uh, are sometimes volunteering their time uh, at the local level and those that are in government service who have raised their hand to say, send me, I'll go and serve that community. He says FEMA has delivered more than $5 million in relief payments to East Tennesseans since Helene hit. He also says FEMA's work isn't just after a disaster. The planning, the pre-positioning of asset, that occurs in blue sky days. We are well partnered with emergency management, public safety officials all across this country. And this particular reason that was reporter Avery Gingrich reporting. Anyone in need of assistance can find more information at FEMA.gov, TN.gov, and through your county's emergency management agency.